Mickey! How you going? Fifteen years. Ah, great to see you, Frank. Welcome home, Jack. Courtesy note. All fines must be paid before check-in. Thank you. Have a nice day. Welcome to Utopia. Citizen Departures 676. I can't wait to see Margaret. So glad to be back home. So what's been happening? Anything at all? No, nothing's changed. What a beautiful day. Processing. GPS coordinates confirmed. I'm starting the car. What do you think I'm doing? <laughs> what the... Did you throw out any rubbish? No, nah, of course not. Is that yours? Hey, it's by a bandana. Yeah. It must have fallen out of my pocket. So what? What are you doing? I'm looking for a credit card. A credit card? What for? The car won't start unless I pay the fine. Now you understand? How about this one? It's Margaret's. The car's in my name. Well, so? Margaret won't mind. <sighs> Can't believe we're walking. You live an hour away, Frank. Anyway, who find you? I didn't see any cops. There are no cops. Anyone can find you. Gee, things have changed a bit. We hardly noticed. Margaret. Frank, have you seen my credit card? You left it in my car. That's great. Just great. Why? I just got fined. Can you drop it off to me? I'm walking. Oh, no, not you too. What are you looking for? Some beer. There's no beer, Jack. Besides, alcohol is bad for you. You know my mother, Frank. Is that a camera? New regulations. There's one in every home, in every room. It's for our own good, Jack. You gotta be kidding me. Are you telling me Alcohol that the- Alcohol is illegal, smoking is illegal, and we're all much healthier now. And our insurance premiums are low. <coughs> this is madness. What's become of this country? Just keep your voice down. Why? You gonna fire me? Did I just get fined? <laughs> this is too fucking much. What the hell were you people thinking? Don't swear. This is too fucked up!
Your government, fuck. Your rule, I fucked up. You're all fucked up. Have you finished? Go fuck yourself! Now I am! Follow me. So it's all come down to this. Mm. No choice. Mm. People started making their bathrooms bigger and nicer than the rest of their houses. But the government and council caught on fast and set limits to the size you can build your bathroom. Is there anything you don't get fined for? <laughs> I'll have to think about that one. What are you doing? How's this work? There's a government app on your phone. You point and take a snapshot of any offence and the government gives you 10% commission from every fine you record. I can't live like this. Sure you can. We're creatures of habit. You'll get used to it. Here, have some food. I don't need in bathrooms. Tell me what? I'm sorry, Jake, but you can't stay. Why? $2,000 in fines, Jack? What the hell were you thinking? We also get fined because it's our house. I promise to pay you back. It's not just the money. You've affected everything we do. Until we pay our fines, we miss out on shopping discounts, public transport, bank loans. Everything. I'm your brother, Frank. I can't fight it anymore, Jack. We hate it too. Why don't you just get up and leave the country? We can't leave. Why? We have a mortgage. Any debts, big or small, you can't travel outside the country. Simple as that. All the changes started happening slowly after you left. I did the protest. But teenagers and hippies on the streets aren't convincing enough. Can't blame the people. When your belly's empty, you swallow anything they shove down your throat. Artists were supposed to turn a mirror on society, but instead most of them turned the mirror on themselves. And it became a selfie. And most writers, artists, poets sold out too scared to challenge in case they lost the corporate sponsor or some government grant. I'm old now. I'm tired now. I've done my fighting. like to live out the rest of my life with the few freedoms I have left. I'll leave in the morning. Jack, just some advice. If you help anyone with a red wristband, you get fined too. 
But whatever you do, never ever pay for anyone else's fine. Hello. Hello. Are you okay? Why are you sleeping here? I don't have a home. Why don't you sleep at a hotel? They won't take cash. So where will you live now? Here. Processing GPS coordinates confirmed. <laughs> Ticket, sir. See you. So your ticket and passport, please. I'm sorry, sir, but you have unpaid fines. Margaret, please, look, I'll pay them another time. I've got to get out of here. Sir, in order for your check-in to proceed, you need to pay the outstanding fines. Why are you doing this? How much? $2,000, your credit card, please. I don't have a credit card, I've only got cash. We can't accept cash. Margaret, please, press some button. I beg you, fix this. I've got to get out of this country. Please. Please move away from the counter. If you do not move, I will have to fine you. I don't care anymore. Sorry, Jack. I know you are. I forgive you. Have a safe flight, sir. Your question? Why are you always smiling? Because I'm free. <laughs> <laughs> 